Welcome everyone to KPE Paranormal and tonight I am here exploring the Wheeling Covered Bridge. I do not know if it's harder or not. I'm going to see if I can capture any paranormal evidence here at this bridge. I do know this bridge was built in 1877. It's a beautiful historic bridge. I don't know if we're going to capture anything but we're going to find out tonight if we do. I brought some equipment with me. So without further ado, make sure to like, share, comment what you see or heard in this video. And let's get started and make sure to subscribe to this channel for more upcoming videos. Let's get right into it. So I'm here at the Wheeling Cover Bridge. This bridge was built in 1877. I do not know if it's haunted. I'm going to do an exploration here if we do hear any voices or if you hear any voices or anything paranormal let me know down in the comments this is what the bridge looks like as you can see wheeling covered bridge 1877 this was near was built I got my tripod set up, ready to go. I want to show you around the bridge first. It is around 57 degrees here tonight. Feels a whole lot better than it has been. I have Gypsy's Crystal Eyes with me. He might film. He's getting his equipment and stuff ready. Let me know what you all see in this bridge during this walkthrough. And then once I finish with this walkthrough, I'm going to attach the camera to the tripod. And then we're gonna start our investigation. Right now I'm showcasing this beautiful historic bridge. I also got night vision attached onto the camera as long as with my video light. There is rocks on both sides of the bridge so you cannot drive on the bridge you can see the structure of how it was built how they have like X's on uh, pillars pretty cool and these big huge doors to open and close I think It's a very short bridge. I'm trying to be careful because there is cars just drive by on this road. It's nearby road. See, Willing Covered Bridge, 1877. This is the other side of the bridge. Goes into the forest. As you all heard, the car just drove past by. When I was at the cemetery a while back, like last week around Christmas, um, my video light actually shut off due to spirit activity because they were using energy. I charged my light before I came here, so if there is any paranormal activity, 
and the light does go dead. That's why as well, because I did fully charge the light, like I did last time. But the cemetery I was at was Rosso Cemetery, and there's like plenty of paranormal activity there. So, like I said, I don't know if it's hotter or not, but we're gonna find out. And Gypsy's Crystal Eyes just now got his equipment finished, and he's getting ready to get started. Make sure to check out his channel. Getting ready to put this camera on top of this tripod so we can see if we can capture any paranormal evidence, if there will be any. Let's get started. Alrighty, so apparently, even though I charged my night vision IR, it completely died since so I uh, set everything up. Could be spared energy that drained all the energy from that IR light. So we're gonna use the video light. Let's hope if we can capture anything. So, so far, we only captured one evidence and that's the spirit draining the energy off the night vision IR light. Let's see if we can capture any other evidence. Let's continue. This is Gypsy Crystal Eyes. You do know I'm a Romanian Gypsy and I am a Senator Medium. The only thing I can pick up, and I'm gonna have Dylan take the camera that way real quick, is a Fae. It's called a Woodland Fae. It's something combined with a tree. They're like nature beings. And it's right outside this bridge. It could be drawing the energy from his camera because they like to play tricks on people. That could be the only thing because I don't pick up any spiritual on this bridge. At least none. And if you step back this way, you can see the fade markings and everything. It's this tree here. But if you step back by the truck field and point it towards it, you can see the whole body of it. Because it's that one right there, and it's it's like a bound in the one. That's a, a woodland peg. If you ever get close enough to one, you'll feel the energy. And this is what they feel like. They are peaceful energy. They feel like you're like, and uh, I think of poppies. Have you ever seen like the Wizard of Oz? This is how I can describe it the most. You feel peace, relaxed, like you just want to go to sleep. And then you feel like you got people watching you. And it just very humming. Because you feel like no negativity near you. Wooden fays are not evil. They will try to make you fall asleep but then give you good dreams. That's their thing and they protect the area they're near. And you'll feel like real peace, real sleepy, real drained. And then you'll feel happy through the whole thing like you're jolly, like Santa. And the uh, fay that he's talking about is over in that area by the tree. It is that tree. Yes. Let me know if you all see anything over there. But so for that, I don't see nothing on that bridge. And that could be the reason why my IR night vision was drained so quickly. Because of that fay, trying to get energy. I think it's a female. And I think her name is Jar Ross. And I'm gonna say it again, Jar Ross. Like drows almost, but like drow was. I think that's her name. I'm going to take a K2 meter towards it, see if we get any energy from it. I have this K2 meter that I'm going to use in to see if we can pick up any EMF detections near this fay. Be careful because you're going near an edge. You will get lightheaded, Dale, the more closer you get towards it. And you'll start feeling happy, like you're really relaxed. Now, I do know it does talk like through spirit boxes and stuff. and It does like the conversate they do. Uh, to check into that, 
Try turning on your spirit box safe to talk to you. I'm going to set up the portal box because for some reason, I don't know if it's this ghost meter, but this has been having a problem. So for some odd reason, it could be the motherboard on this device causing an issue. So we're going to use the portal box to see if we can communicate with the Fae. I don't sense nothing else though. I'm being totally honest. But I will bring this up. If you're near this area where this is, Please look out for this dog. It's been Mrs. September. For it can get back to its owner. If you are in this area, like he was saying, we did see this posting of this missing dog. His name is P Dub. If you see him in this area, contact the person on his phone number. He's been missing since he or she been missing since September 10th, 2022. I would greatly appreciate it if you have any information on the finding of this dog and give it to his rightful family. Every animal serves to be with its loved ones. Yes, and it's very friendly as you can see. Alrighty everyone, I got the portal box set up and we're getting ready to do the spirit box session here at Willing Covered Bridge. We're gonna to try to communicate with this Fay. Let's get started. I will let everybody know Fays are very rare. They don't usually show their stuff like this, so if you guys do hear it, and it does speak, they are speaking of if they want to be, like I said, and usually they are, but if you do get one on it, be gifted that you got it, and they don't show themselves too often. I can tell she's old. She's very beautiful. I wish I could get down towards her without hurting myself getting down this thing. I'm trying to communicate with the Fay that's here with us tonight by this bridge. Can you say hello? Point the camera a little bit closer. Right in the back, you got the box box. That's what she keeps telling me. Do what? She keeps saying you're riding on the rock you got your box on. Yeah, it's right there. She said she's been here for years. I'm gonna let her talk and you can hear her. Since the 1930s. You've been here since the 1930s? I said your name a minute ago, so we confirmed that was your name. That is. Thank you for confirming that. I got a question for you. Were you the one who drained his uh, night vision thing on this? I think she said that's right. Is that what you just said? That's definitely. Did you hear it? Yeah. <laughs> Do you like us being here? Hard, yeah. I heard it. That's very faint. It is, because you're not going to go slow, but you're getting a decent one, but not that good. She says there's many of us here. 
but I'm the only one close to the bridge. I ain't going anywhere. Not for some time. That's what I heard. Is there a reason why you're not going anywhere? She's not the guardian of this forest and of this area. You're the guardian of this forest and you protect this forest? Yeah. Now I got a question for you. I didn't pick up any spares on this bridge. Is there any on there? There's nothing. Did you hear it? Yeah. I hope you didn't pick nothing on this bridge. Is there anything in the forest? Yes. They should rock. I can see them. They're not evil. They're like uh, woodland creatures, elves, mystical creatures. Huh. This is like a, a dimension for like a third eye almost, where they can come in and go. And I would recommend you going that at night. They will torment you if you go there at night. Yeah, they said don't do it. No. No, don't do it. That's what they said. Because you're on their domain. Right. And they just confirmed saying they do not want you to go down the forest. The only thing can end with that is a healer. And that would be a druid. Or a Native American. Did you hear that's right? Uh huh. I want to see if I can make out what that says. WT Washer. Card. A N. Power. It's barely can read it. She said it's very old. Yeah. It says used to be a washer bridge. She said they used to use buggies and stuff and go across to the old, old, old cars, but it didn't weigh much. Can you tell me what year this bridge was built, please? It was very low, but I just heard it. Yes, I did too. And low, 1877. It was very low. Yes. Thank and she you said, so much. She said there's a wishing well from the 1800s around here. She said it's still there. You can see it, but be careful walking. <coughs> Deal. She said, be careful. Walk this way. Do not point your flashlight into the forest. You'll see it. It's like a homemade wheel. Take the camera and see if you can get it too. But be careful. She, you heard her say, be careful. There's a river. She says, it's down there somewhere. Maybe it's on the other side of the thing by the river. Yes, did you hear? Say. Uh -huh. Is it still being used today? No, did you hear? Yeah. Thank you for telling us that. I would love to touch you. Before I can feel your beauty. Because I know it's how I feel really fast. I'm getting ready to turn this off. 
so I can explore some more around this bridge. See if we can find that well. Is there anything else you would like to say? Be with you. No doubt. Thank you for those messages. She's talking about the future. I don't know if I can say that. Do it. Alrighty. Okay. According to her, she said. If anybody believes in Christ and revelations, there's a car coming. There, we're in the revelation state right now. Quote me if I'm wrong. You're right. Did you hear it? Yep. Okay. And she's sitting there saying the first plague was the first seal, what was COVID. She said this year God's getting ready to really hit us hard. There's so many people dying this year, like celebrities and everything else. She said that she said this right here that a lot of them are being took from her who has sold their self and God's wiping them out because he's getting ready to come back and claim his and that's what was said and there's a response that came out in spirit box saying that's what I told you so the tone and he's to be saying prepared. that this next plague there's a male here standing right beside her And he sit there and saying, the next plague is going to be horrible. And it's not going to be good. It's going to be really bad. Yes. Said. Is there any other messages you'd like to say before I turn this off so we can explore the rest of this bridge? No. You heard that? She wants to say goodbye, that's all. Can you say goodbye? <laughs> goodbye. Thank you for communicating. Let me know what y'all think about that spirit box session that we just did. There is a lot of amazing evidence and EVPs about that faith that we just communicated with. Right now, I want to take and film Gypsy's Crystal Eyes while he walks around the bridge. I want to leave this camera here with the tripod here. Let me know if y'all see anything while I do that. Let's continue. The only thing you might see is mystical creatures like elves, gnomes, fairies. They're very hard to catch, but if you catch one, a fairy is like a little bright light. Um, a gnome and, a, and stuff like this, elves are like shadows. I'm giving you what to look for. So if you see this, you know what you've seen. Anything else, I couldn't tell you what it is without me seeing it. I can tell you the only thing I do pick up from this from energy, from touch, since I touched it a minute ago when I was sitting on the rock here, where you've seen me. And this is what I can tell you. This bridge is visited by different people a lot from different generations since it's been shut down i can see where people has i do know there's markings over here what i'm picking up somewhere on this area there's something here i'm picking up and there should be something over here see if you get close enough to deal with light for if you can pick up writings Yes, yeah. right here. Yes. Turn your camera this way afterwards for you can see it. I'll hold the flashlight. For you can see this part. And then you can show that on the ground. Right 
writing here, writings we're always talking about. There's writings. Let me zoom in. And there's graffiti on the ground there, but you can see it real well right there. Like I said, I don't pick up any ghost on this thing. I will tell you that, but if I do see anything, there's some right here. What talks about names and stuff? There's names, initials. Anything that I get visioned of, I'll show you from the past. I'll be glad to point out to you. If they tell me anything in the future, the way my gift works, I can to a degree, but if I go too far, I can get punished for it. The Fae is the one who revealed the part over here in the future, just letting everybody know. And any all my viewers, you'll see this too. I will be using a little bit of this footage what, on this, and you'll see it on mine too. So just letting you know. So it'll make sense to you. Alright. There's something over here. I don't know why I'm picking up, like a TC or something. On something in a JT over here. Uh, see if you can find it down. And there's something over here too. There's a T and L. And see if you find a JT too or something over there. There sure should be a JT over there. And a JT. Right there's there. something over here. I don't know what it is. I'm picking up like a pentagram, maybe a star on this side. A pentagram? Or a star on this side of me. Or a star. Right over in here, where my arm's waving. Walk around and see if you see it. Is that if I move out of this energy where I'm at, I'll lose it. Could be very, very faint too. And I'm also picking up a CAD over there, too. There's an X, but I don't see no star. There's I'm also picking, right there. I'm picking up a CAD over there. I'm also picking up a star over there. And I'm also picking up an LT I'm on this side. There's an X, but I don't see no star. Let me see if I can pinpoint. See if you can find that LT too and all that. No, I'm also, and I know it's over there because I'm picking it up. Um, on um, your side, where uh, over here, right there, right there. Look down. LT. LT. Yeah. Now let me see if I can figure out because I can't move too far. I can only try to glance where I'm at. Look on the beam here, Dale. See if you can see anything on the beams. You might find it on that, like the star or something or names or something because uh -huh. I'm letting you know that's where they're most likely right is this floors sure. just giving you a heads up there's AT <clears throat> right here Dale I'm, I can't move off this spot right here there's writing I can see something what's this Barely can make it out. Is that a star? Uh, yes. Yes, it is. I'm also picking up a KD and uh, IS nearby, somewhere in this area. That's a very thick K. There. No, it's clear. I can, I, I can, I can really see it. it's fresh carved. It's a fresh carved deal. Check this out here. See if I can move without losing sight. Oh, I never, I didn't see that. That's not it. That's too old. I'm seeing a fresh car. This is like Doug. Doug in it. This is Doug in it. Let's see if I can find it. Right there? That's not it. That's like Kevin, rest in peace. Dylan, yes. turn your light back. I can see something. Right in that area. Yeah. Is that KD? It's KL, but it's D. Yeah, that's it. I bet you that's what I'm seeing. Probably. Yep. 
KD, I said yes. <laughs> it's KD. And I, yes. Yep. See if we can move on to see if see anything else. Okay, now I can move from that spot. Let me move over this way, see if I sense anything. The only thing I sense over here is where, over here is where, over here is where somebody died. There should be a rest in peace over on this side somewhere. Well, I don't know where. And a GM or GH over here, and right beside it should be saying close by rest in peace. Or, you know that? Yes. Or, it's, it's the Faye. She's kind of talking to me. See if you can figure out, see if you can figure out where I'm seeing it. Like I said, a GH, GM, so I guess an arrest in peace. Over this section. There's a T A. And there's a T H near beside it, rest in peace. T H. See if you can find the rest in peace. I can't go too far because I'll lose signal. I hope my camera picked up that voice. So I clearly heard hey. Right there! The rest in peace. So whoever it is, the name should be beside who died there. Can you make out the name? Um, I can't make that out, so... No, Gloria? She died here from a heart attack. But she's not gone in this. She's moved on. I'm trying to see if I can pick up anything else. John? Now I'm picking up another letter to like a what I was saying. See, bring it this way. So we can pick up this other letter to I was picking up. Ooh, right there. Okay.
like cheerful people talking. I think they had chairs lined up on this, going back that way. And they walked down the middle part here, where I did. So right over here is where the well is supposedly be at in this area where my flashlight is at underneath the bridge. And you can see there's like a river. And other people sold up exploring this beautiful bridge. So you might hear them talking in a video. They're cool people. But this is what it looks like here. From the bottom of the bridge is like a little river. Flashlight is about to die. Spirits like to take energy from it. I always like keep mine charged. For some reason, they just like to take the energy off the flashlights and follow my lights. That was where the well used to be at. And like I said, it could be covered up because it was from the old 1800s, like, you know, from the old times and it's never been used. So that's probably why it could be covered up. So that's what it looks like in that area. And this has been KPE Paranormal. This concludes this investigation slash exploration. We have captured some evidence here at this bridge. While walking in this bridge, when I had my tripod set up, I heard a voice saying, hey, Hopefully I caught that on camera. Let me know what you all heard with a timestamp down in the comments or seen in this video. Make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more upcoming videos. And until next time, love and peace.